exposing all the flaws. Spy came in the bag, got the vids on tap. Guilty love is slipping, walking right What's into the What's going on, you young little bounty hunters? You, it's Bounty Hunter D, and thank you for joining me for another episode of Yes, the Bounty Hunter D Show, where we talk to amazing couples about their relationships. And who do I have in the building right now? What's my special amazing couple? Go ahead and introduce yourself. My name's Anita. Hi, Anita. Pleasure to meet you. How you doing? My name is Byron. Yes, yes. What's up, B? All right. Relationship time. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Byron, did she tell you that you're going to be on the show today? Yes, sir. And you're going to be telling the world about y'all amazing relationship? Yep. And you ready to do that? Yes, sir. But well, let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> how long y'all been? Ready for anything, right? Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. So how long y'all been together? A little over two years, mm -hmm. two years and like two months. Yeah. Amazing two years. <laughs> okay. All right. You can't stop staring at him, huh? Look at him. Is he always like this? You Would know you? what? He's putting on a little extra right now. I'm not mad about it. Like I'm feeling it. I was going to say know? the attention is good, isn't it? <laughs> I think we're both excited, you know? <laughs> yes. Yes. So things are going well in your relationship, I would imagine, huh? Yeah. Ups and downs. Ups and downs. Uh, you know, he does travel a lot for work, okay. um, especially in like the last year or so. But um, you know, we make sure that we always spend time together at home. Good. You know, I I love cooking for him. It's one of like, my favorite mm. things to do. So like our yeah. meal times are really important. Yeah. Mm. yeah. yeah. What should be chopping up? What's his favorite meal? You... Ooh, I make some mean enchiladas, but enchiladas. like enchiladas. Okay. Um, I, I can kill a steak sando too though. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's my favorite. <laughs> right Little provolone, yeah. grilled onions. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Um. So you guys live together? Yes. How long yeah. has that been? Uh, not quite two years, um, but uh, we have a nice little place in Orange County right now. Okay. And uh, I don't know, it's not too close to the beach, but like we still get down there pretty often. Right. You know? yeah. So you yeah. guys are outdoorsy couple. Yeah, I like the sun. Okay. Yes. And you travel a lot. Is that for work or is that what is it for? Uh, for work, yes, sir. Okay. What do you do? Uh, I'm in telemarketing. Okay. So. Unfortunately, I have to go back and forth to Florida and stuff like that okay. for meetings and stuff. And um, hey, it helps pay the bills. Hey, and, gotta make the money. Yup. And if that, you want to keep her, he always brings on the bacon. You know, he takes uh, good care of me. Yup. Uh, I brings brings home the veggie burger. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta make that money if you want to keep her, though. Come on now. Yep, Come you. on, man. Got you. Yep. you know, you gotta have a job. Yeah. Right? I'm a big believer in you got to have some money. You want to be in a relationship where you got to have some money, man. Yep. Don't no woman want to be with no brocat, right? Exactly. And vice versa. You know, and he works hard. Money. He works really hard. Yes. Yeah. I'm always busy. Right. Always. <laughs> so how often are you out of town? Uh, usually it's about three times a month, but frequently it's been like a little bit every other week and stuff. Okay. And, um, so it's picked up? Yeah, is it picked why? up. Why is that? Um, I'm looking for a promotion. So, okay. you know, I'm steadily working hard, you know, okay. I'm taking every meeting and stuff like that. And um, I'm just trying to do the best for, for us, man, you know, good, man. for our future man, I family. Yeah, I love hearing that. <laughs> I do, man. Them good old relationships. Yeah. So has he met your family? Are you, uh, you're Latina? Yes, yes. Okay, has he met your family? Because you um, mentioned enchiladas. <laughs> it's a big family, okay. you know. Um, <laughs> I took him to my tia's house, and um, I think it was the first time you'd ever had a tamale. Yeah, like tamale. Oh, yeah. no doubt. Um, so uh, it was it was really funny to get him to to get to watch him experience that first bite because like I don't know sharing food is something that like I think it's like one of the the breaking points into intimacy. But um, yeah, yeah, my 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 aunties could not stop talking about him and like hitting on him, but in Spanish, you know, it was, oh, it was great. Oh, <laughs> are they older? The they older, are, uh, yeah, abuelitas? yeah, yes. So they, they, they've all got some gray going, but um, I don't know, my tias are kind of like my sisters in the way. I don't have any siblings. So um, my, my aunties and all my cousins, um, they've all met him and they, they love him. So uh, it was a, a big deal for me to have, you know, the approval of my family and yes, um, my mom and my papa, you know. Yes, yeah. that's important. <laughs> Yes, and has she met your family, brother? Yes, sir. And what they say about her? They love her, honestly, <laughs> especially her cooking. She was able to cook some of her uh, dishes, mm -hmm. tamales, enchiladas, and stuff like that. Her they cultural, loved it. cultural dishes. Yep. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then they they loved it and they love her, you know. And um, they they want some grandkids. 
Mm. They sure do. They yeah. <laughs> so the rabbits, you know how rabbits are. So everything uh -huh, uh -huh. good with the rabbits? Y'all still doing rabbits? <laughs> yeah. Rabbits are okay? You know, I would say that we have a healthy life. Um, I don't think we're, <laughs> I don't think we're trying to like have kids right now. Okay. Um, uh, we'll probably get a, another dog soon. Uh, we, we did have a dog that just passed actually in January, but oh, sorry he that. was my rock throughout that. That's the closest to babies we've ever gotten. Yeah, they are. But, um, you practice a lot though. Yes. I think we both do want, uh, you know, a family someday. I sure. think that's like a dream of you ours. You want that too? Because I hear her talking about you. You want that oh, too? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Definitely. That's Definitely. important. Yeah. I agree on that. Yep. But Definitely. you know, uh, it, it, it just takes time before you can like commit to life like that with somebody i feel like i feel like we're getting there you know it's only been two years but um but it feels like it's been longer it oh, feels yeah. like we've known each other it feels like we've always known each other it's because you live together <laughs> yeah when you live yeah. together things just it you know it's yeah. like you get you well first of all you start telling the truth right because when you're dating you're lying everybody yeah. listen everybody <laughs> who's dating y'all lying right now to each other because the guy is trying to impress you and you trying to impress him and it's all lies right <laughs> until you start living together and then you can start seeing his habits and what he does and vice versa mm -hmm, right now mm -hmm. you're getting that real good food right you're like oh, oh yeah man, lord have mercy you're getting food and rabbits uh, <laughs> rabbits and food you can, what can, more can you ask for right yeah, i don't cook rabbit but yeah <laughs> well you know what i'm when i reference rabbit you know this is an adult show so i don't like to say you know i don't like to say the word but you know what i'm talking mm -hmm. about right i just kind of make it a fun word because yeah. you know we have the little ones watching us so we want the little ones thinking about rabbits but we know what we're talking about right well, you know, when we think about little ones, I think um, that's something that might be easier when, like, maybe you don't have to travel so much, you know? Um, I understand. That yeah. seems like it's a sort of a, a burden on your relationship, it seems. I think it's hard sometimes. Like, I understand that, you know, he, he, the work is important, and um, I really value his work ethic because, you know, I have a strong one, too. But, like, um, you know, it's hard. It's hard when your partner isn't here sometimes and what do you do oh i uh work in catering actually <laughs> oh well hence the food yeah. and knowing how to yes so, makes sense. um i only do like small private events you know because i i also keep a home but like um is it your business yeah yeah oh, well, uh, it's just something i've been doing since high school to be honest congratulations so. yeah yes another <laughs> thank you thank you uh -huh. i was gonna yeah. say entrepreneur i gotta be careful but that's okay <laughs> everybody's in <laughs> to me that's fine yeah everybody's it's a positive yeah, yeah. thing Anita's food. Good, yeah. Feels great to be black. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. So, if I have to ask you, my brother, yes, sir. All this good stuff, you know, about her, <laughs> um, the cooking mostly. Mm -hmm. um, is there anything that you could share with the audience as far as her character that you love mm -hmm. about her character? Uh, okay, so number one, she cares a lot. Like, so <laughs> if I have the meeting. Right, like, and they're very frequent. She would help pack my bag. She would be like, "Baby, you need this. You need that." She even meal preps for me, you know. Wow. Again with the food, you know. But of she's course. amazing to cook, and um, I, I, I just love that. You know, it, it feels good to know that someone cares for you, and cares about what you're doing. Because what I'm oh, doing. Oh, she care about what you're doing like a mother. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. And she yes. knows. What I'm doing is for us. It's for us. We're, I'm, I'm building over here. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? I, I have a five-year goal, 10-year goal. That's good know? to know. And um, honestly, I'm not going to lie. I think in the future, in the future, I'm going to get married and stuff. I start a family, well, that, you know, <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm, I'm out here grinding. Okay. <laughs> I, I love that. I love the plan. I love all of that. Wow. But you know, marriage is a very, very and I'm married, obviously, but marriage is a very big step. You looked at my finger like, where's this ring? Don't worry. It's, a, it, it's around my neck. <laughs> my ring is around my neck. You got to worry uh, about tan lines, right? No, no, it's not that. <laughs> I don't, you know, I, and I've, I've been asked that several times. Like, do you marry? You don't wear a ring, but mm -hmm. I, I don't, I just don't believe in the ring. I believe my wife, she can wear whatever ring she wants. I buy her a brand new rock mm -hmm. like every two years. Mm -hmm. but well, you know, a ring I, is a symbol, but. For who? 
for 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 everybody. Sometimes it signals uh, hold on, hold on, to hold on, people. Pause on that because it's not a symbol for me, right? So it's a personal preference if someone wants to wear a ring mm -hmm. because I'm very. I would rather be vocal than just have a ring here. I would rather tell a woman who want to talk to me that I'm married. It make me feel good. Mm -hmm. Well, like that's wonderful because the ring is a sim is a symbol, but like. What really matters is the action. Like the ring doesn't actually mean anything. The ring don't mean shit to me. Unless you can stay committed. There you go, bingo. Mm. But if people want to wear a ring, I don't, you know, I always say this though, I am very selfish because I always think what's good for me is good for everybody else. That's just <laughs> my little selfish thing. But I think it's good uh, to be very vocal about being married. I think it's great to promote marriage. Mm. I think it's great to promote uh, intimacy with your wife and, and exclusivity, oh, right? Yeah. Exclusivity. Google that. Google that. Because when you're in relationship, that's what's important. Not this around my finger to hoard off other women. Because let me tell you something. If a woman wants you, she don't give a damn if you got a ring on her neck. Mm. It don't mm -hmm. matter. Oh, so yeah. you have to have it in your mind and in your demeanor, right? Your mind is, I'm married. Your demeanor is, I'm not hanging around all these women. A married man shouldn't be hanging around other women like that and having female oh, okay. friends and shit. Yeah. So, like I said, it's very selfish, but that's just what I believe, that what's good for me is good for the entire world. <laughs> if you're married and, or and you're in a committed relationship, you don't need male and female friends, which leads me to that question to you guys. Mm -hmm. Do you have male friends? You know, I have a couple, like, from high school that I still keep in touch with. Uh, they're all married, too. You know, they have mm -hmm. kids, and uh, I see them, too. So... Um, is, it, is it mutual friends with all of both of oh, you? Oh, he's he's met my friends. Yeah. Like we didn't go to high school. So together. you guys are friends together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's different. I That's agree different. completely. Nothing wrong with that. Completely agree. Great. Yeah. What about you? Do you have female friends? I unfortunately I can't really have friends with the business that I'm in, mm -hmm. but I do have associates though, male and female. An and associate is a part of the work work related. The associate is a high and by. That's not really He's, when yeah. I say friend. I mean you're calling her. Hey, what you what you doing? Oh, y'all going out? I'm gonna come out with y'all, hang out. You know, well, going over to their house. That's like a friend. But an associate is. Well, yeah, like I said, uh, unfortunately, you know, I'm always it's, busy. It's I'm not unfortunate traveling. to me. I think that's great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always traveling and stuff sure. like that. Sure. And um, I'm so glad that Anita has friends and stuff, especially that we build bonds in high school with and stuff like that. But I'm always traveling and stuff, so it's just right. with my associates, work friends. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've met a couple of them, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's good that you <laughs> don't have any female friends, man, and I applaud you for that. I applaud you for not having any new friends. You have old mm -hmm. friends that are in relationships, because this is what people need to hear. This is the right way to do it. He has no friends and she has friends that are married and they're all friends together. And that's mm -hmm. how you do it in a relationship. And we make friend, we make new friends together, you know? That's, yeah. man, y'all making Uncle D feel good about this, man. This is the way it's supposed to be. Definitely. I get so much pushback too, even from comments too, when people say, mm -hmm. oh D, I got female friends and all this other stuff. That's good for you. I'm not telling nobody what to do. I'm just sharing because I got a platform. I'm just sharing my life with y'all, my story with y'all. Right. <laughs> so I think I applaud. I think that's great, and I applaud you guys for not for not doing that because male and female friends get in the way. They just get in the way. They're distractions. Yeah. You should be all about her all the time, <laughs> and you should be all about him all the time. And I a man, am. he should be the only man you need, and you and she should be the only woman that you need. Exactly. Is she the only woman that you need, bro? Oh, yes. She's the only woman that you have? Yes. Oh, okay. What the only you? one I need. Is she is she the only one you have? The only one I have. Is the only, only one, one I need by everything. Okay. All right. Everything. So <laughs> I'm going to change the conversation. What okay. don't you like about her? Because, you know, everything is great. Everything is, you know, we focus on the good. Who mm -hmm. wants to focus on negativity? Mm -hmm. But on this show, we talk about everything as a relationship show. Mm -hmm. So what don't you like about her? It's okay. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> is it, wait, is it that bad? No, He's like, is your show, baby? Because I don't want to end up on the couch. Don't worry, baby. <laughs> what don't you like about your beautiful queen? So, like I said, I travel a lot. Okay. Okay. When we are spending time with each other, the TV being on at night, 
kind of racks up the electricity bill. Hey, but you know, I'm always working, like I said. So I just kind of wish, you know, you just turn it off, you know, or just pause it or whatever. So she leaves like lights on and stuff like that, and the AC, everything. The AC just running. We got to okay. Yeah. And okay. Hey, That's it, a pet peeve. You can get a little pricey, you know, mm. but. <laughs> like I said, fortunately, you know, I'm working, I'm staying busy, mm -hmm. so I can afford these things, the bills and stuff like that, but right. it is kind of shocking, though, okay. every month paying for that. Is there anything about her character in the relationship that you wish you could change about her, or is, every, is, she, or is she just the perfect family for you? <laughs> Sometimes when I get my business calls, you know, she wants to know who it was, what it was for, Okay. and I'm just like, hey, babe, you know, like... I gotta do what I gotta do. Okay. You know, like I can't, I can't really tell all of that. You know, like I'm telemarketing, I'm traveling, I'm, I'm looking to, to be an executive. Sometimes you gotta just keep it moving and stuff, and she, it, it bothers me. I'm not gonna lie, and I'm sorry. So you have a, is it like a portfolio that you, you have to work? Your portfolio is it all in Florida or is it all over the country or was it predominantly um, mainly in Florida? Mainly in Florida. Mainly okay. in Florida, and um, like you said, I'm just building that portfolio. Okay. And um, yeah, I'm just trying to be the best that I can be. Okay, fair enough. Fair you know? enough. And um, yeah, baby. So you know it's her <laughs> turn now. All right. So what don't you like about him? His character. And, and it's okay. Uh, and feel free to it, talk to him and tell him what you told my. Yeah, I like so much about you. You know, I, I love so much about you. You know, that's not a concern for me. Um, you know, like you mentioned, like when you're on the phone and stuff, sometimes it is hard for me because I feel like we'll always be in the middle of something and you get a call and you're gone. You know, sometimes it's just the next room where you just like leave the apartment and that's okay. Like you get, you need your privacy. I understand you're doing business, but sometimes it just, I don't know. I, I get these like alarm bells. Uh, it's, it's 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 called that woman's <laughs> intuition. No, I understand what that is, and that's 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 real. Uh, so that's real. I, sometimes I feel like I, I I doubt you a little, and I wish that I didn't. Maybe it's a me problem. But like, I I get these moments where like, I I almost wonder, you know, baby, like and wonder you, what. I I don't know. I, I when 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 I ask like who you've been talking to, like you know, what was it about? It was it's just work. It was just work. You know, like, um, I, you don't have to report to me or nothing, but I, I want to know what you're doing and what it's about. And because I, 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 I care, you know, your, your work is kind of like, it's part of me too. But baby, I'm, I'm working for us. Yeah, I know. I'm working I know. for us. You know what I mean? I have so many executives, CEOs calling me, you know, I gotta, I gotta handle it for us. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes that's not even important who I'm talking to or who I'm on the phone with, emailing, messaging. Mm -hmm. That's not even important. Okay, so let me let me kind of uh, let me tell you a little bit more about this show. Okay. Uh, this show is about relationships, obviously. Mm -hmm. We're chopping it up, right? Um, <laughs> this is also an investigative show. And what we do on this show is that we expose cheaters. We catch cheaters. So the reason that you're here is that she reached out to us about your relationship and she wanted to find out if you're faithful. Me? Yes. So she brought you on the show today to take a lie detector test. <laughs> Baby, we were talking about marriage, you know? Like, I, yeah. I, I, just, I just need to know. I just need to know. I, didn't to I told you, though. But you, you don't tell me. Like, you don't tell me anything, you know? I... I guess I just need a little confirmation that like what you're not telling me is something I don't need to hear, you know? Yeah, hold on, what? Nah. It, it would make us I'm so doing, much stronger, man. you know? Just, just to know, just, it would, if, if this is just a weakness I have, then like maybe, maybe I can just prove it away, you know? You wanna take the to take the test too? Like, I it's Baby, I me. would absolutely. Actually, I, no. It's just, it's just for you. It's for me. Yeah, it's just no, for you me. know what I'm doing. You know I'm working. That's what I do. So the reason for the lie detector test is, I'll say it for her, is because she thinks you're cheating on her. That's why. 
Anita. Anita, for real? And she also said to the producers, and I, I don't know if it still stands, but she also said, if you don't take the lie detector test, is that your relationship is over today. That's what she said then. Do you still feel that way, Anita? Yeah, I do. Nah, okay, so there we go. On, nah. Yo, you, you know, it's just for me and you, we building. Baby, any time that I call you and you're in Florida. I'm working, I'm I, working. You know I'm You're working. always working with women though. You are, there's always a woman in the room. I can't help it. I don't know if it's the same woman or not. Of course But not. like, I just. So. So oh. I need an answer from you, Bubba. A yes or a no if you're gonna take the test. I'm gonna take the test. Okay. And I'm gonna pass it. Of course. I'm gonna pass let's, it. let's do that. Yeah. Let's take the Baby, test. Thank you. It, it, it would mean uh, so yeah. much. I'm, I'm I just I just need to know, you uh, know, and like mm -hmm. I'm sorry, you know? Baby, baby. I got you. Watch. Okay. Watch. All right. And we'll be back right after this. Download the app and watch the most amazing content ever on the internet. Watch Roar right now, 24 hours for free. What are you waiting for? It's the greatest deal ever. Okay, Bayern, have you ever taken the lie detector test before? Never have. Okay, so we have some rules. Um, you always look at that wall, the white wall in front of you. Uh, you keep your hands to your lap. When I ask for questions, I don't want any reason behind. And your answer should be yes or no. Okay. Okay. Um, she's going to see these results too? Uh, well, we're going to uh, give the results to my husband and then he's going to read it. Uh, to right. both of you, actually. To okay, you. gotcha. Okay. Okay. So let me know when you're ready, okay? I, I'm ready. You're ready. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. about to Let's ace this. It. Yeah. Is your name Biden? Yup. Yes. Okay, I'm going to ask you again. Is your name Biden? Yes. I'm gonna need you to be a little, you know. This is hot in here, though. Okay, yeah. so it's few minutes, so we can get through. Is your girlfriend's name Anita? That's my baby, yep. Okay, I'm gonna ask you again. Is your girlfriend's name Anita? Yep, yes. Okay, I'm gonna ask you again. Yes or no? Is your girlfriend's name Anita? Yes. You hear me? Uh huh. Shit. Can you get some AC? It's, it's the AC is pretty cool in here. All right. Okay. Have you ever flirted with someone else while being in this relationship with Anita? No. And I don't care who you heard that from either. <laughs> it wasn't me. Have you ever given your contact information? to someone with the intentions of having a relationship, romantic or with that person? Like I said, I, I work on business, so okay. no. Uh, let me ask you again, because I don't care about anything behind your answers. I don't care what you do for business. I don't care that you are in business. Just give me yes or no. Have you ever sought attention or validation from someone else that you two only seek from Anita. No. Told you I was my baby girl. Yeah, we're gonna see about that. Oh. <laughs> okay. she ready? I'm ready. Have you ever downplayed or lied about the nature of your relationship with someone outside of Anita knowledge? No. I just to let you know. I told you, I'm building. I'm building over here. And we want to, we want to start a family and stuff like that. Okay. Silly yeah. ass questions. Silly so ass questions. I don't give a shit. So just give me yes or no. I thought y'all were supposed to be nice. And uh, I don't know who told you that, but I never said that I'm going to be nice. I said give me the answers that I want. All right, then. And, I, and, and listen, I don't care what you do on your free time or what you do for nothing. I make money. 
and I don't I make give a money. Shit. And I don't give a shit. Just give me yes or no. Yeah. Can we do that? Let's just get this and shit move over. On. Yeah. Have you ever entertained the idea of living and need it for someone else? No. That's my heart. That's my heart right there. Are you thinking about another woman right now? Yeah, you're. Because I want to hurry this shit the hell up. Okay, so you shouldn't be thinking in my. You ask me questions. You ask me questions and shit. There. I got all these silly shit on me, man. Shit. Okay, let me ask you one more question. Let me see if you can get through this. I hurry this shit up, man. For real. When you stay still, I'm going to ask you. Are you cheating on Anita? No. Cheers got cut. Faces turned to dread. Bounty hunter D. Got them all checked. Made it. Lies unravel quick. Stories fall apart. Truth hits heavy. Arrows hitting hearts. We are back. Yeah. <laughs> we are ready to review the results of the lie detector test. My guy. How do you feel you did? I aced that. You think you aced that? <laughs> no doubt. Okay. No, oh, I don't got nothing. Hey, hey. I got nothing. Nah. Okay. Now, they, they about to tell you right here. I'm going to tell them real quick, but my wife did say it was a little bit of pushback. Like you were kind of a little antsy in there. I guess he kept complaining it was hot or something or oh, yeah, that yeah. we need to eat. And it's cool in there. It's like in the front part of the studio is like 70, is it 71 degrees or something? Yeah, something 70. like that. They said that? Yeah, but when you're in, under the hot seat like that, you know, of course, you're going to get a little bit warmer. Under pressure. Yes. So that's what I'm thinking it was. He was just under pressure. Do we have the results? <laughs> so you think you aced it? Let's see. I know I did. I'm, I'm excited to see this. I actually got a meeting right after this. Okay. Well, let's see. Thank you, Mr. Invincible. Uh, and I, and I, you know, we, I told you about that, the meeting. Yeah, after yeah, this, yeah, yeah. You said you got a meeting after the show? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's hope you're still in the relationship after. <laughs> My wife asked him a series of questions, and the series of questions is uh, he has to answer either yes or no. Just yes or no, that's it. No explanation, no reasons, just yes or no. Uh, first question she asked, is your name Byron? <laughs> Easy baseline questions. He says yes. Lie detector test determined that is a fail. You failed on your name. That should be always though. Okay. That's all, that like, we can't, you know. Like, she you asked know, you, you know is your name. girlfriend's name Anita? He said yes. Lie detector determined that that's also a fail. You see what I'm saying? And these are usually our baseline questions, like questions that we know they're going to get right to sort of, you know, set the pace and the tone mm -hmm. of the test. We can see where it's jumping and if it, you know, if it jumps outside of uh, like the next question let's say it jumped outside of those first two baseline questions we know that those are lies so that's sort of how we base it um Maybe. but looking at this if you Maybe. if you fail the two baseline questions bruh i mean and, that's easy what's your name do you have a is byron your nickname or is it your middle no, no, name that's, yeah that's that's my name like i said it was hot in there though it was it was hot as hell in there. so you blaming that sweat that you, your name was baby did you ask him like, his name uh, one time, two times? It's on his license. Bring bring it. You got the test? Did you bring the test in here? Let me see it. Yeah. All right. Let me show you something. Here we go. Here we go with this. Well, this is let me just show you what you're not gonna know what you're seeing until I explain it to you. Okay? Thank you, I you're welcome. So this is his, these are his test results, right? They're just gonna look like squiggly lines to you right mm -hmm. now, right? Um, when you see the, the green there, that's his breathing and the red indicates a lies or him being uneasy, right? So uh -huh. this is where it starts and this is where it ends. So you can see during the test, you know, he was not having a good test. It's a really shitty, I mean, lines so should be completely straight. He's you know? not even a professional. Lines should though. be completely straight. He's not even a professional, though. That's the thing. I can, you mean keep it here? I'll just keep it right here. This is set up. That could be someone else's. Now, why do I want to set you up, dog? I, I'm, For what? I, I don't know you, dog. I don't know you, plan. You why see I what I got over here. Uh -huh. and I see what you got over there. What you talking about? You know, I'm building. Ivan, come grab this. 
I'm, I'm building. I'm okay, working. But, so, but I'm just saying, what, what do I have to gain? Thank you, bro. You're welcome. What do I have to gain? He's part of the crew. I don't even trust him. I don't even. I don't even... You don't trust him. Ivan is the most trust, one of the most trustworthy his, persons, people I've ever met. Ivan, Ivan is my brother. His, his name is, what is Ivan. For a living. His no, name his, is no, Ivan. No, no, no. I'm gonna correct you. His name is Ivan the Invincible. He's got his own. Come here, Ivan. Hey, what, what the hell? You See, got no, me you want to talk for? about my guys? You're talking about my crew. That you don't trust my crew. You shouldn't even have to worry about my crew. Do you want to say something? He's right here. You ain't got to talk behind his back. He right no, here. No. He looks like he do MMA. I'm good. Well, he does. I mean, <laughs> you look like Yoda, bro. Okay. We done? I'm just saying. Yeah, I, we good. I just, you know, I thought maybe watch, he wanted watch. to say something to you. At, watch. Let's I'm get a... back to the test. I'm gonna get back to that. Yes, please. Because we we're not trying to do no smoke on here. We don't do that, unless we got to. So you, you, you failed the first two questions. Next question my, my wife asked you, have you ever given your contact information to someone with the intention of developing a romantic or rabid relationship? Trust me, right? You trust me. We couldn't get an answer out of him. He just failed it. Nah, nah. Why couldn't you just nah, give a straight yo, answer nah, though? No, yo. Like, have you ever downplayed yes or, no? or lied about the nature of your relationship with someone outside of Anita? He says no. You won't let lie this man lie. Lie detector test determined that's a lie. You won't let this man lie to you. You won't let this man lie to you. Outside of her knowledge. That's you, what I've been you asking myself. You won't let this man lie to you. Have you, you ever sought the attention? I'm going to talk to you, baby. Is he just going to keep running this mouth? Have you ever sought the attention or validation from someone else that you should only seek from Anita? He says no. Lie detector test determined that he also that failed that one right there. He failed that. that I was Have you ever entertained the idea yeah. of leaving Anita for someone else? No, and he over there mumbling and shit. He says, no. Lie detector test determined he passed that one. Who told you? I told you. Oh, so now I told you, and before it was all you, now I told you. I'm so you got working. one. Right, and now it's I'm, okay, yeah. I'm working, I'm building. You're building, okay. And uh, she asked, are you thinking about another woman right now while he's taking a test? His answer, she wrote, uh, he was thinking about your ass. Like, so you told my wife, I'm no. thinking about your ass. I didn't even say that she so was So I didn't know if he was test. talking about my wife's or her personally, I don't know. Nah, bro. But my nah. wife has an amazing juicy so I don't know if he's <laughs> checking her hooked. out. But, but I'm they, just saying. When they had to ask me, I, I wasn't even hooked up to that uh, when they asked me. so hard about a yes or a no? It was hot as hell in there. So he did answer. The sweat. Eventually. Are you thinking about another woman right now? He says no. And I don't know if we caught that on film. Lie detector test determined that's a lie. So he was thinking about another woman. It, it had nothing to do with my wife. Another question she asked you. Last question. Are you cheating on Anita? Of course not. We couldn't oh, get through the, we couldn't get through these questions because he was starting to get irate. Are you cheating on Anita? He says uh, no. Uh, lie detector test right there. Determine that's a lie. He's a goddamn liar. I ain't got. I have nothing to gain by li by lying on you. Because he's jealous of art. What the? F is that going <laughs> I'm on? jealous. Okay, I'm jealous. I'm building. I'm working and shit, it. man. Nah, no, no, no. I no, no, knew no, it. Anita, Anita, you made Anita, me think Anita, I was Anita, crazy. Anita, Anita, Anita. Anita. Oh my God. Anita, I didn't told you though. I didn't oh told you. God. How long? How long? How Ain't long no you been doing this? I've been working. Working? I'm what, working. Working someone else's ass? Oh, what? Hell nah. Nah. Why don't you just tell her the truth, man? I, I, I am. Okay, so. <sighs> I am. Okay, I told you this is an investigative show. And y'all lying. Oh, well, I don't just go off the lie detectors. They I go mean, for proof. I go for way. This is like a, a cheetah show on steroids. <sighs> You can't even believe a lie detector test. That shit is false. Okay, well maybe she can believe this person that I'm gonna bring on the Zoom. Who? Right? Who? Maybe she can believe that Who? person. <laughs> Who? I just told you it's an investigative show. Okay. And Anita, you don't know about this, but before I bring this person on my show, do you wanna tell Anita maybe a little secret that you have? Maybe a secret in Florida that you have? I've been working. You just, you've been Build, building for you our relationship, building. baby. And you already know this. Have you been spending time with another yeah, woman? Hell no. I don't got to spend no time with nobody. Okay, let me show you this. Let me show you this. I don't this. give a f 
who he got on oh, there. Oh, you don't care who I have on here? Hell nah. Oh, you don't? Okay. And I told you, yo, they be lying and shit, bro. Oh, my God. There you go. What it look like? Who that? This is his girlfriend in Florida. Yo, if you believe that shit, I swear to God. What, what, what's your name? This is his girlfriend. He's cheating on you. Boom. Right there. You know him? Nah, that's... Okay, look, hold on, hold on. Who the hell is this? Who hold is on, that? hold on. What? She, she know girlfriend. about you. She's surprised right now because y'all ain't never meet because we've been know? working and shit. We've Are been working and shit, yo. He says he nah, works with yo. you. Does he Come work on, tell with her. you? You work with this? That's, that's my no. associate. Your associate. What you not? Yo, come on, he over there at the screen and shit. Shut up, shut up. What are you saying? I don't work with him. He been taking me and my kids to Disney World, taking us on cruises. Oh, shit. Hanging out with them. Nah. Okay, so who's so so look off of so this her, shit, her, her, name, her, her name is Valentina. This is Valentina. Valentina? This is Valentina. Valentina? You told me Valentina was your grandmother. Nah. Your that, grandmother's man. name. Oh, no. Nah. Are you? No. Nah. You have no, that tattoo you know almost it's my a year. Name. Almost you know, a year. I'm wearing, we oh work together. God. We work oh together. God. We work together. Oh in Florida, we work together in okay. Florida. I spent years Come of my now. life with you. Nah, nah, Anita. I stood up at your Anita. sister's Anita. wedding. Anita. So, I Anita. So, you're in a relationship Anita. with him, correct? Say no. Say no. I am. Say no to not. How long you been with him? You don't even got answers. Right, these questions. Don't care. Why don't you talk to her and get your answers? A He's going to be lying. Talk to her and get your answers. A year. You're full of shit. He's been you been full of shit. No. Hey. He's been, he been talking to me about marriage no, and moving in with me and my kids. Are your kids? No. They're not his kids. You, you don't have a kid. I told with him. you I, no. had, I had that situation going you. on where I had to help somebody. I had to help somebody. Help somebody. And what they, was they needed, they help needed help. And oh I my God! I need help. Val I didn't need no help from you. I didn't need no help from you when I met you. I didn't need no help. Valentina, how long have you been with him? How many years? Months? Tell me. A year. About a year. Why are you talking about this time last year? And you are not Florida, correct? Do not touch me. Okay. So when he comes to California, what excuse is he giving you that he's coming to California for? Come on, come on, baby. I mean, he told me that he works out there. And that you know he comes out here to because he wants to spend time with me, but he works out there, mostly lives out there. So when he comes to sleep for weeks, I mean it's it's he it kind of has it like that. You know, house over here, house over here. You know what I mean? That's how he makes it feel. I've been hearing the same shit for, for for the last year. He goes to Florida for work. Mm -hmm. He's always at work. He's always talking to work associate. He's. Yeah. A, and you know what we was working no, on with the company. You, you know no, what we what was working company? on with the company. Just your life. What company are you talking about? And I had to do what, what I had to do for the what company. What you had to do. What, what you had to do. do with me. I told you I didn't oh want nothing God. to do. I said I was here and I didn't want nothing to do with what? Yo, because she's, she's in a situation. Oh, oh, she she's in a situation. And you know, oh, my so company. Oh, you're just helping her we out. Have tax purposes. Excuse me, tax what situation oh, am I in? Oh, oh, my God. She's confused. Valentina. <laughs> yeah, my kids are good. We didn't need you. Valentina. I can't believe it. God damn. He has a tattoo on his arm. Are you, you already know that. And it says, yes, I know. it says Valentina. He went, yeah, we okay. went together after we had a beautiful day. He said, I feel so. So, I just want you cool, to love me forever. Cool. Okay. So, he, were you with him? Broke because he's got it on his arm. Were you with uh, him when he uh, got that tattoo or not? Yes. Okay. I just want me. just for proof. Is it? Is it? Let me see. Does it say her name? Okay. I don't got nothing. Can I see it? Right. Okay. So it says Valentina so, right there. That's a, he told me. There. He told me that tat. was his grandmother's name. He told you that was his. He told me he got and it as a memorial to okay, his but grandmother. But you, you have a tattoo of her right there on you. Oh coincidence. A coincidence. Okay. It's a coincidence. Okay. All right. This oh. is life. Coincidence of what? This is life. This is a coincidence. This is life. What do you mean? This Come is on life? now. Yo, this is life you? alone. That's no. men. That's what that is. No. You're a. Yeah. I didn't. Kids Disney World, motherfucker. Don't bomb. tell me about it. I'm okay. so sorry. Kids Disney World, I'm sorry. 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 I
girl, girl, listen. Nah. Don't. Hey, how the f you hang up beautiful. on this, man? No, don't you touch that. Don't, 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 don't touch that. Don't, 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 don't touch my shit. We don't need this man. We didn't need you. They paint actors and shit, man. They paint. Come on now. Hey, actors. So, so I had her. She an actor, and I had her tax your name on your arm. Yes, thank you. Oh, for real? Look how stupid you sound. Bruh, you look you through a screen right now. Really. You're so lucky because you really not. Mm. I'm about to take it there. I'm not going. I'm about to take it there. I'm about to take it there. Okay, we already took it there. I'm about to take it but there. But we already took it there. You want to take it? I don't know so who the f she is. This I don't know who the f she is, is man. I'm the one who's carrying you on your shoes. Wait, I just see me this week. We have threesome for you. Byron, are you dead serious? Nothing was enough. And that was on my birthday. I want to oh hear my her. God. That was on my birthday. You said you were going to do that on my birthday. I cannot wait for you to have a birthday. Anita, Anita, hold on, Anita, 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 just give me a second. Give me I want to hear call. Valentina. Valentina, talk about your relationship with him. And I know this is hard for you, but I want to give you a chance to talk. Man, we he's trying to talk over you, and you have a lot to say. And you know what? Anita deserves to hear it, and so do you. So go ahead and talk. You can talk to me, because he's just trying to talk over you, so go ahead and talk. Yeah. Ain't no so you. he's saying Thank he you. doesn't know you, and this got a tattoo right here i looked at the tattoo and he told her he told her that's his grandma so i want, I want to, so talk talk to them talk i want her to talk so how long have y'all how long have y'all been together give me the facts he had been together for a year he met me in florida i met him in florida and then he pursued me okay and he said, I want to be there for you. I want to be there for your children. I want us to Boy, be Boy, if family. you touch me right now, I'm going to smack you. If you, you guys don't mind, me. I want to hear her. She's on my show, so I'm going to ask y'all, please be quiet. So he's pursued you for a year. He pursued me. So he was taking me out to nice restaurants when I was in taking me to nice hotels. Eventually, he was like, I would love to have kids. I know you care for them. So let's, I'll take them to this world so I can treat you guys. So this is what he did. He took us out, and he was supposed to be coming to take us on a cruise. And talk about moving here and marrying being a family like oh that. Like God. he's telling me, and I didn't pursue him. And to be saying all this is crazy. This woman who I don't know. I'm sorry, Anita. Right? I'm sorry. I didn't know anything about you. I was involved. I would not be involved with some man who had a wife, a whole wife. That's not how I move. I do not move like that. So I'm really sorry. But that's the, the honest to God truth. The man has to come in the sending me, pursuing me, wanting to start a life with me. Girl, I, okay. I knew. That's what I wanted to know. Okay. I knew it. This is, is what I wanted is to know. Is she done? Oh, we're done. Oh, done? I'm sure. Oh, yeah. you're so, done. Did you want right. to give a piece of your mind before I let you go? Did you want to say anything on the way out? I mean, honestly, I need a girl who do better. Go get a new man. Cause this, this guy, is a, he's a whole. Yeah, no, he he's trying to shush her. He's trying to shush her. Yo, okay. You're done. No, no, no. You're done. You, come come and get you, this, Ivan. Ivan, come get this. You still owe me for sure. Listen, Valentina, I appreciate you calling <laughs> in. <laughs> appreciate it. Sure, what you're gonna charge her for right. the dates you took Thank her you. on? It was charity work. It was you, charity work, charity work is being in a relationship you with you. All right, thank you, Ivan. Thanks. You're welcome. You're welcome. Yeah. Anything else? I just, just go over. Give me some space. Yeah, so you still lying, bro. You just still lying. I don't know what the f Yo, I don't know what the f you got going on uh -huh. over here and uh -huh. shit, but... Hey, all right. Oh, cool. okay. Well, what cool. are you doing? What are you cool, doing? Yo. What are you cool. doing? The gig is up. The okay, gig so is you're going to admit it? Wait, you're going to admit it? Okay. The gig is up. Okay. Go. You're a cheater. See? So we caught him. There you go. Babe, I told you it was charity work. You, you was in the shower when charity I had told you. Work. It was one time thing. It was charity work. Charity work. Her and her little ball Charity kids. work. Her you do charity with kids. that You do charity I with your do, hands? I do not, I you do, do charity with your lips? I do none of that. Anita, you know. You already know. Bitch. No, what you I knew, know. what I knew was just proven to me. Okay? You know? What I knew just I'm got building. proven to me by this wonderful gentleman. Oh, his thank you. Okay? Because what I knew it. I knew it, B. I knew. I'm Bonnie Hunter D, man. This is what I do. This is what my team here. This is this is yeah. the Welcome nights that I spent show, a thinking about show, you, hey. wondering, thinking, how dare I? How dare I suspect? How dare I doubt you? But you know what? It was true. It was real. That was like that was Christ telling me in my heart that you were just on me.
You know I'm Buddhist. That's number one. I'm Buddhist. You're not. I'm I'm you oh, have an ounce of faith in oh, you. Shit, yo. Okay, I think I'm you're full. Cool. Yeah, I, gotta do. I think so, you're a so, liar. So do you admit? God damn. You admit you know her. Obviously, you said the gig is on. So you admit you know her. You just out here ruining. You must know her. No, I expose shit. I expose cheaters. I'm not ruining the relationship. Building and shit. Okay, that's fine for you. Building. But you're out here lying too. Building lies. Babe. Babe. Don't call me baby. No. Do not. Baby, ever way. again. That's number one. Got me up here. Why does that matter? <laughs> I told you I don't. God damn. Why does you know him from the TV. Are you still gonna be with him? No. Damn yeah, right. Okay. So do me a Hold favor, what? man. Uh, Just focus you know, on what the I game deserve? right now. Just walk oh. your ass, like all the way out to the lobby and all the way out to your car before something bad happens to you. <laughs> yeah. So I need you to take that walk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I need you to take that walk. And yeah, just because you tall don't mean shit. Uh, exactly. I mean. Yeah, but this is an opportunity. And if you want to wait outside, I mean, oh, no, don't, on, don't do that. Don't do you that right there. Don't, don't slap. Don't slap. No, this is my girl. Don't slap. This is my woman. No, 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 bro. Anita. I'm not your nothing. There you go. Bye. Walk all the way out. I even make, I even make sure this mother get off my get off the property. Oh, oh, uh, he can handle you by himself. I don't even I'm, need I'm to go. Let's just go. Let's just go, bro. Come on. Yeah. Goodbye, Byron. Anita doesn't want you anymore, just walk. Anita! She just got caught, faces turned to dread. Bounty hunter D, got them all checkmate.